Prince Harry's best friend's wife thanks Meghan after polo at Santa Barbara. Meghan and Delfina have become close. Nacho Figueres wife Delfina has praised Meghan Markle for capturing an emotional family moment. Meghan and Delfina were both at the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club on Friday as they cheered on their husbands Prince Harry and Nacho in the league final. Their team sadly lost, and Meghan caught on camera the moment that Delfina and their daughter Aurora gave Nacho a big hug. This shot sums it all up. Yesterday we may have lost this game. But it was a win since you decided to go for this team and build something even more special and powerful, Delfina captioned the post. Love supporting you and love standing by you, she added before concluding, gracious emperor la photo. Harry joined the team in May and has spent the last few weeks playing alongside his teammates. Which includes his close friend Nacho, a professional polo player who founded Los Paris. Last month. Nacho shared his delight at being reunited with Harry at a match and shared a photo of their special time together on Instagram. He wrote, thrilled to be riding alongside my friend, Prince Harry. And the rest of the Los Padres team at the It's Santa Barbara Polo Club's Harry East Memorial Tournament. We've ridden together many times over the years and now that we're both parents, it's extra special to be able to spend this time together, he continued. He added, the name Los Padres was inspired by the proximity of the field to the Los Padres National Forest and also by our connection as fathers. Harry and Nacho have been friends for over 13 years and bonded over their shared love of sport and philanthropy. Meghan and Harry did it to venture far for their day out as the club is close to their home in Montecito, where they live with their two children, Archie, three, and one-year-old daughter Lilibet. Meghan wore a light blue denim outfit as she cheered on Prince Harry in California. Meghan is Prince Harry's biggest cheerleader. The Duchess of Sussex supported her husband as he played a polo game with the Los Padres team in California. Meghan wore a light blue denim shirt and shorts ensemble as she joined Prince Harry at the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club. She paired the outfit with flat Grecian-style leather sandals and a pair of sunglasses. In one snapshot, Meghan appeared enthralled by the on-field action as she stood on the sidelines to cheer for her husband. Prince Harry, alongside his friend and the founder of his team, Ignacio Nacho Figueres, were playing in the semi-final against Folded Hills. However, they hoped a battle in the final did not come to fruition after their team ultimately lost the match on Friday. Last weekend, Prince Harry was spotted at a polo game with Figueres and their teammates playing against Dundee II. The match which was open to the public, ended with the opposing team winning by 12-8. Markel was reportedly not in attendance at the event. Earlier this month, Harry and Markel publicly reunited with senior members of the royal family. For the first time since they stepped back from their roles as working royals in March 2020, the couple made their appearances in the UK. During Queen Elizabeth's for days of festivities to commemorate the monarch's historic 70-year reign, during their trip across the bond, Meghan and Prince Harry brought their two children three-year-old son Archie and one-year-old daughter Lilibet. The trip gave Lily the opportunity to meet a great-grandmother, Queen Elizabeth. For the first time, she is named after the monarch whose childhood nickname was Lilibet. On the 4th of June, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex invited close friends and family to gather for a casual intimate backyard picnic at their Frogmore Cottage home to celebrate daughter Lily's first birthday. Before sharing a candid photo of Lily a few days later in honor of a milestone birthday. Fans are watching avidly for a glimpse the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and their children, Archie and Lilibut. As the family is currently in the UK celebrating the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. But Meghan and Prince Harry have kept the kids out of the spotlight so far during the many events planned to honor the Queen's 70th year on the throne. Luckily, Meghan's hairdresser George Northwood, who is also a good friend of hers, gave a little glimpse into the royal family. And shared a bit more about what three-year-old Archie and one-year-old Lilibet are really like. On Friday, Northwood shared several photos of Meghan at the Queen's service of Thanksgiving at Street. Paul's Cathedral. She had her hair up in a sleek chignon, covered in a broad-brimmed white hat, and wore a matching Dior coat. In the caption, he wrote, So nostalgic and wonderful to be reunited Harry. Meghan and their family in the UK. Archie has grown to be the cutest, well-mannered little boy and Lilibet is just beautiful. 
the Duke and Duchess have released very few photos of their children. Just a handful of Archie and a Christmas card featuring baby Lilibet on their Archeol website in December. This is the first time they have returned to the UK as a family since Lilibet's birth. Meghan and Harry moved to Montecito, California, after deciding to step back from their official roles in the royal family. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos. Thank you very much.